What's going on guys, Shane here. I'm here with the man, the myth, the legend, Boss Root, and the guy that got me inspired to start self-defense training and tutorial videos. So he's gonna show us a, a little tip. Take it away, Boss. Which he does very well, I have to say. You know, I really like his videos. That's why I reacted on a request from you. Otherwise I wouldn't have reacted. It would have <laughs> sucked. I said, nah, I don't wanna be identified with this guy. Okay, rear naked choke defense. A lot of times the best thing is, if you're a fighter, to jump. But put your legs around, this is very important because otherwise they might step behind you. Now first he's going to do it with me. The, the first choke I would uh, suggest you to do is to move to the side. Now look, most of the time I take the one closest to this side. So I go behind him, here, grab the legs, and then you can lift him <laughs> and slam him down. If you're heavy, or if he is heavy and he's got the choke on, what you can do if you're a girl, you can step behind him, just fall backwards. You see, he has to brace his fall. Otherwise, he's gonna fall with his head on the street. This is a nice little judo mat, of course, on the street. It's not that nice. Now, the problem comes when somebody grabs your rear naked choke and lifts your feet up and presses his shoulder back. A lot of people don't do this with rear naked choke. They just squeeze. But the space here, see, it doesn't do anything when I squeeze. When I pull my shoulders back, hey, now suddenly it closes. So you need the guy to release. You still you need your feet on the ground in order to go backwards and to drop me. Now, there's a trick you can do. I can't show it. First of all, maybe I'm too heavy for him so that he can carry me. But second of all, I have a Ford Fusion, front or back. Maybe not such a good idea. So, he's gonna have to go fast. This yeah. is gonna be five seconds time and he's gonna be out. So it's gonna go fast. I'm gonna lift him up, feet from off the ground, and then he's gonna do this. Oh, slam. Yeah, and now try to keep up under and go for that escape. If I wouldn't have gone to the ground, you could have gone behind me just like I did with you. But there is a reaction. And some people say, yeah, but if this guy is really tough and he keeps holding, you lost. Mm -hmm. But if you don't try, if you don't shoot, you always miss. That's what the saying is. Right. Say so it's important at least to try. Throw it up, slam it down, and then make the move. Needless to say, practice, practice, practice. Yes. Yeah, I mean, I get these negative comments all the time in my videos, boss, that say this would never work in a fight. And so we, you got to try at least something. That's it. You know, if, you don't, if you're not going to try, you're going to give up before the fight even starts and you're going to lose. You're going to have the saying in Papa Guy, you know, the guy pulls a gun, he's not wearing a mask, puff, puff, shoots two people down, you're left. You really think he's going to let you live? Because you're going to be a witness now, you know? So this guy, you need to go. So instead of just standing there and getting shot, you might as well run to him and try to do something. Maybe run and zoom, do whatever you want to do. Mm -hmm. You increase your life expectancy immediately mm -hmm. by doing that. Is it still maybe? It's, it's a lot of his uh, part, but there is a chance. I heard um, cops who shot a guy six times and still he gets stopped. So there's a lot you can do even when you get shot as long as they don't hurt the vital organs. Yeah, yeah. And the one thing that's really important too, guys, is that you're in shape. Right, so that you can last in a fight like this. Maybe you're fighting multiple people, but that you have the lung capacity to do so. We're talking about bosses, go-to trainer. Go trainer, right? A lot of people have been asking me about the uh, the training masks. There's there's really big Ophi ones. This one is nice and compact. Uh, we got a link in the description below. If you want to get one for yourself, holidays are coming up. All right, so check it out, guys. Leave some comments in the description below. Anything else you want to say? Merry Christmas, everybody. Right. Merry Happy Christmas. New Year. Yeah. Woo. Happy holidays, guys. Till next time. I'm Shane with Fight Tips. Boom, boom, and boss root. Godspeed, party on. Self-defense for the underdogs.